Hey, we're back. Of course we are. And uh, we're gonna take the. Yeah, I knew we'd get attacked again. So, hello. Just gonna flash by. E. That was close. Okay. Pretty early action right there. So, I'm gonna switch to flares. And turn that on just in case they decide to get attacked. Well, in case they decide to attack me, in other words. Yep, like that. So I'm going to use a flare just to defend myself. Get back. Okay, there's, I think there's two left. There's one over there. And where's the other one gone? I knew there was a third one. Where is he? Oh no, there's more. Right, flashbang it is. Nice one. He did. Sorry about that. Alright, that's all of them. Let's go. Which way? Let's go this way. Another light, which means more enemies, I'm assuming. Right. Run. Keep going, there's another light here. Oh, turn it on, quick. Turn it on. Oh, there's five of them, I think. Oh, he ran into my bullet. Oh. Back off, please. You get a shotgun in the face. <laughs> Owned. <sighs> oh, wait, we're here. It's this way. <sighs> yeah, the, yeah. A few parts ago I said, I don't know why people have trouble with this game. It's pretty easy. But yeah, I'm having trouble now. Oh god, what's that? Great. That's just great. I have to go the up there as well. was moving ahead of me in the same direction I was going. A cold feeling settled itself in the pit of my stomach. Was it going for Alice? I hope not. Uh, don't creak. Don't creak at me. I guess this is a bit of a graveyard. And a bit of a monster. A graveyard shift maybe cause cancer. Okay, so this is a boss battle. Just a random grave digger. Where's he gone? Oh, he's over there. He ran away. Wait. Is that two grave diggers or just one? Oh, it's two grave diggers, I think. But I got them with the flashbangs and finished them off. So it's all good. It's all good. A bit random, but all good. You need to throw a boss at you or now and again. Checkpoint. Now I have a feeling I've not been this far in the game before. Bet this comes alive behind me. I'm pretty sure I've not been here before. The place was dead. A ghost town. Had been for decades, maybe a century. That's nice to know. Whoa. What? What's throwing things? Things are getting thrown at me. Oh. That's not good. Oh no, the car's alive. Not for long, it's not. Whew. I'm still shivering. I have no idea why. The flashy thing there, I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a manuscript page, that's cool. Oh, I have been here before because it didn't pop up in the corner. So now it's waking Casey. Things were never as simple in real life as in fiction. I had lost count of the times I had wished there'd be a clear reason for my writer's block. Something to fight. Something to lash out on. There wasn't. I was filled with doubt. I was nothing like the hero in my books. Alex Casey had gone through his life with single-minded determination, never wavering from his goal. 
Even now, I was angry at myself, angry at Alice, angry at Barry. I was fumbling and I had no plan. That's nice. I have no idea who Alex Casey is, but I'm sure we'll find out. Okay, don't collapse on me. More of these. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Shut up, bridge. Actually, no, you can collapse all you want now, because I'm already over you. It's over. I'm over you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this looks a bit creepy. Batteries. Need the batteries. Without batteries, this game is hopeless. I'm sure later on in the game I'll need to start preserving my batteries a bit more. Let's have a look in here. Something on the floor there. More batteries. Pick them up. Pick them up. Thank you. Okay, I don't like the noise. It sounded like a rustling in the bushes. I don't like that. Alright. There's some weird noises in this place. Although... Someone squeaked. Yeah, can you hear that? It does say cross the ghost town. So, if... Oh, that tree scared me. If it's actually saying cross the ghost town, I'm guessing it is a proper ghost town. Okay. Checkpoint. Ah, oh, that's loud. Hello. Yeah, I remember this part. I've been here before. Uh, okay. One. Hide, hide. Come get some. There you go. Hide behind objects. To defeat objects. Right. Ah, That tractor. Better not come alive, I was gonna say, but yeah, there you go. Ah! Hee! Yeah, see, if that sign if that post wasn't there, I would have just probably had a lot of damage done to me. But I'm kinda stuck right now, surrounded. Ow, I was a bit too late with the flare. Where's the other one? It hit me from behind and kind of bounced into the air. But where is it now? Oh, it's there. Right. Yeah, I remember this bridge. I'm near the part where I stopped playing the first time. I don't know why I stopped playing. I think I bought a new game and... Oh, shut up. I bought a new game and I just kind of started playing that one and kind of lost track of this one, so I just didn't pick it up again. But um, I decided to do it as a let's play. So that's my first proper one as well. So I'm hoping you guys like it. Oh no! Whoa! Um, yeah, that's a bit big and it's taking a bit of a while to kill as well. There you go. Oh, you're over there. Hide behind the tree. There you go. Come on. There you go. <sighs> These inanimate objects are really using up my batteries. Have a look in here. What's in here? Pick up. Oh, it's a key. Don't know what I need that for wasn't listed as an objective but it's used for this door I, I suppose I don't like that sound it's like a fan can you hear that? oh hello Anything it's me outside of riding is a struggle I feel ill I managed to make my way downstairs there's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane it's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of muses and creators summoning fabulous things from a magic lake, using his powers to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. 
Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Zane believes it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness above, where some Lovecraftian presence lurks. I crawl back upstairs. I'll borrow these things from my story. They ring true. They fit. So basically I'm following in the footsteps of Thomas Zane, and Barbara Jagger is Alice, basically. So that means, if things happen the same way as Thomas Zane and... I don't like that noise. Rustling noise. Don't like it. Yeah, if things happen the same way as Thomas Zane and Barbara Jagger, then I will become a light and Alice will become a scary woman, but hopefully that won't happen. Um, swap out the shotgun for a hunting rifle. Should I do it? How much ammo do I have? Only three. So yes, I think I will. Although I've only got five for this, but there's loads here. Eleven bullets. Yeah, that'll do. I can always get a shotgun later. Oh, what's shaking? Oh god, that is so close. It's only like a mile away. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's literally right there. You see that broken tree? Okay, I'm scared. <laughs> Reach the mirror peak lookout. I think I remember this part. And it's up there somewhere, I think. But I have no idea. I can't remember. I don't think I ever made it to that on the last time I played. So the next part will be the last part of the sitting. Unless summit happens like a cliffhanger and I decide to do another one or two parts. So, uh, yeah, cool. Excuse me. Hope you're enjoying it so far.